Hi guys, Pioneer Field Agronomist Alex Knight here in Northern Ohio. Today we're in a wheat field of 25R40. Um, this field actually experienced low temperatures in the 27 to 28 degree Fahrenheit range about four nights ago now. So what we're wanting to do is evaluate for freeze damage, see what we have going on. When we're evaluating for freeze damage, there's three key things we wanna consider. First, what was the actual temperature that that plant got down to? Um, was 27 or 28 degrees an accurate representation of what that plant received? Or in some of those low spots, was that temperature a little lower? What growth stage is that crop at? Different growth stages can withstand different low temperatures. So we also want to evaluate that. And then certainly we know there will be differences in different parts of the field. So we want to evaluate those high spots a little differently from the low spots and so on and so forth. So first, when we look at this 25R40, we're looking at about that Feex 8 stage. So we haven't quite made it to boot stage yet. This is actually good for us because when we talk about those joining stages, that temperature low that we can usually endure is about 24 degrees Fahrenheit for two or more hours. Once we reach the boot stage, that threshold becomes 28 degrees Fahrenheit for two or more hours. As we look across the field, we're seeing some burning on those leaf tips. So that's obviously a symptom of um, the freeze damage. However, we're gonna split some heads open here and see what um, what we're seeing on the inside of the plant and if there's anything to be concerned about there. So as we're out here evaluating the wheat crop, you'll notice what we first did was we took a wheat stem, split it in half with a pocket knife, and then what we want to do is evaluate this wheat head. As we look a little closer at this wheat head, you'll notice that we're seeing good color in it. Still looks pretty green. As we squeeze it, we'll notice that it's not squishy. We're really still seeing that turgid seed head that we want to see to know that that plant is still healthy, has good vigor, and ultimately still has the potential to accomplish some really good yield for us. As we've evaluated this field of 25R40, um, looks to still have some really good yield potential, some really good plant health. We really saw a minimal impact from that freeze event four nights ago. However, we still want to look at these on a field by field basis um, and definitely make it a point to go to those low spots in the field. If you have further questions, feel free to contact your local Pioneer sales rep, your territory manager, or your local Pioneer agronomist. Thanks for tuning in. Look for more updates as our season progresses. That concludes this Pioneer agronomy video podcast. Visit our page on pioneer.com and follow us on Twitter and Facebook for more agronomy insights.